This is the Chatter Newscast, coming to you from Reed Custer High School in Braidwood, Illinois. Hey everybody, I'm Emily. And I'm Darby. Welcome to the Chatter Newscast. We're here to fill you in on what you need to know about what's going on at Reed Custer High School for the week of March 2nd. Let's, Let's get, get started. started. We have no school thanks to Casimir Pulaski Day on Monday, March 2nd. You'll hear more about Pulaski Day with the Curious Comments. Character Ed for the month of March begins with the theme of caring. Freshmen have Character Ed on Tuesday, March 3rd, and sophomores on March 5th. Hey seniors, Jostens will be here with your graduation cap and gown delivery during lunch on Thursday, March 5th. Looking ahead, there will be an early dismissal on Wednesday, March 11th at 11.20 a.m. Now let's send it over to clubs and activities. Welcome to Clubs and Activities. The Rad Youth Group will meet in the Commons area on Wednesday, March 4th at 2.30 p.m. The Art Club will meet in the Art Room from 3.05 to 4.15 on Friday, March 6th. FCCLA State Qualifiers will meet after school for practice for the state competition on Tuesday, March 3rd. FCCLA will also be doing the Melissa's Closet and Crystal's Jewelry Box Prom Dress Fundraiser at the Godley Park District from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. on Saturday, March 7th. This is a community service opportunity. The bass fishing team will be meeting this week from 3 to 4 p.m. on Tuesday, March 3rd, and again on Thursday, March 5th. There will be a recycling club meeting on March 5th. There is a music boosters meeting at 6.30 p.m. on March 5th. The IHSA Solo and Ensemble Contest is all day on March 7th. The Varsity's Glass Bowl team will be competing at the Ice Conference at Mantino High School on Thursday, March 5th. And that's all for this week's clubs and activities. Now let's send it over to... Guidance Gossip. Keep on clubbing, Comets! Hi, I'm Monica, here to give you the latest gossip from Guidance. Attention students, our Guidance counselors will be at RCMS all day on Tuesday and Wednesday. There will be a sign-up sheet on the door if anyone needs anything. This is just a reminder that the dual credit placement testing is scheduled for Tuesday, March 17th in Lab 400. Joliet Junior College hosts their spring open house on Saturday, March 21st from 9 a.m. to noon. Take a tour, speak with professors in your area of interest, and learn about everything JJC has to offer. Any grade level of student is welcome to attend this event. Sign up is strongly encouraged. You may sign up at the link below. The Contractors Association of Will and Grundy Counties offers scholarships for students planning to enter into a construction-related field. For more information and to apply, please visit the link below. The deadline for submission is March 13, 2020. The cool career of the week is a flight nurse. Flight nurses get to be part of rescue operations and medical evacuations while flying aboard airplanes or helicopters. They provide emergency care to patients who are in critical condition and need to be airlifted to the hospital. Becoming a flight nurse first requires that you go to school for registered nursing and gain experience in trauma care. The average salary is $61,938. And that's all the gossip I have for this week. Don't miss out, be in the know, and follow the guidance counselors on Twitter and Facebook. See you next week. Hey comments, Jane and Jaden here with Curious Comments. Last week's Twitter poll was about daylight savings time. We asked, what year was daylight savings time first implemented in the United States? Your options were, A, 1946, B, 1918, or C, 1966. We'll be back with the results and the correct answer after the weather with Billy. Hello everyone, I'm Billy and let's talk weather. The first part of the week, we have a good chance of some showers with some partly cloudy skies to end the week and weekend. The temps will range from the high 40s to the low 30s. And now it's time for Wacky Weather. In 1972, a blizzard dumped 26.25 feet of snowfall on Iran. This was the deadliest blizzard in history, a week-long period of low temperatures and severe winter storms lasting six days, resulting in the deaths of approximately four 4,000 people. Now let's talk about global warming. Here is one good tip for how you can make a difference. Reduce water waste. Saving water reduces carbon pollution. That's because it takes a lot of energy to pump 
heat and treat your water. Take shorter showers, turn off the tap while brushing your teeth, and switch to water sense, label fixtures, and appliances. Modern American homes where shift fixtures, about 100 million kilowatts of energy per year would be saved, avoiding 80,000 tons of global warming pollution. And now, let's find out the results of the Twitter poll with the curious comment. And we're back with the last week's Twitter poll results. Time for second place was 1946 and 1966 with 20% of the, of the votes. 60% of the votes went to 1918. If you chose 1918, you are correct. Well, I wonder if they know this fun fact. The Illinois State Senate advanced a proposal in November to do away with the changing of the clocks twice a year. This would make March 2020 the last time you change your clocks. The amendment reads, Daylight saving time shall be the year-round standard time of the entire state. That would mean more hours of daylight for us. Next week's Twitter poll will involve our upcoming spring musical, Big Fish. That's it for now. And always remember to stay, stay curious, curious Comets. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome to Comet Sports. Sports. Hey Comets, Trevor McLaughlin here. Spring sports are starting up. Before we wrap up the winter season, we need to hand out some awards. The annual award nights will be on Wednesday, March 11th at 6.30 p.m. in the high school gym. Let's go, go Comet! Thanks for watching the Chatter Newscast. We'll be back next week with another brand new episode. If you have any questions about this week's episode or about RCHS you'd like answered, send them to us through our Facebook page or Twitter. Don't forget, you can get your daily dose of Comet news. Just like the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on Twitter, and like us on Facebook and Instagram. And finally, here's this week's inspirational message. Have no fear of perfection. You'll never reach it. Salvador Dali. Have, have a, a great, great week! week. The Radies group will meet in the commons area on Wednesday, Wednesday, March, on Wednesday, Wednesday. <laughs>